think I'm a singer sometimes. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel, you guys. My name is Raven, and I'm really excited that you're here to hang out with me. Or I guess you're probably here to do Pilates with me, hopefully. Today, we've got a really juicy beginner full body flow. Um, I love that like these beginner videos have been reaching so many people and I feel like they're pretty much good for most bodies. Um, of course, I'll be calling out modifications, I'll be calling out advancements, so if you're in the middle, this is still the video for you. But all you need today is your beautiful mat. Don't look at mine because it really needs to be replaced. <laughs> but when you're ready, grab some water, grab your best vibes, your most energy, and we're gonna get this party started. Here we go. Alrighty, y'all, we are going to start with some chest lifty loos. So slowly lay all the way down on your back. Just take a few big deep breaths right there. My body really needs some Pilates today, so I am so happy to be here. <laughs> take your hands behind the nape of your neck where your skull and your neck meet. You should feel like you're elongating the back of your neck. I want your feet and legs to be heavy on an exhale. You curl up and then lower back down. That's all we got, chest lift. So we're never thinking about crunches. Keep going at your own tempo. We're thinking about lifting your chest to peer at your belly button. It's not about how high you lift. It's about how you really draw your belly in. Pull this down and lower. Keep that going. Exhale, pull this down and lower. Keep it moving. Big deep breaths. And lower. Let's do a few more here. You're never pulling on your neck. You're just cradling your head so your neck doesn't get too tired. Last two. Last one. Curl up and hold it right here. Now walk your feet and legs together. Make sure you really feel your waistline pulling in right here. One leg lifts, one leg lowers. That's all we do, not too bad. But this should turn some things on in your abdominals. Nothing's really moving but your leg bone inside of your hip joint. Let's go eight. Ooh, my abs are turning on. How are you breathing and relaxing your head and your hands? Four more here, four and three, almost there, and two. Last one, hold both legs up and freeze. Back to chest lifts, three, two, one. This should feel a little different, should feel a little more difficult. Keep going, this is called table top. I don't want your knees in, I don't want them out. I want them right over your hips. I could put a cup of coffee on your shins. Remember, small is good. Pull these down. What if you are resting a cup of coffee on your rib cage too? You don't want it flaring out. Last three. Almost there, last two. Ooh, baby. Last one, hold it up, back to toe taps alternating but we're still meeting in our tabletop position now here <laughs> your abs should literally be on fire i know so if you need to put head neck and shoulders down do it who cares <laughs> right this is your modification right here you don't have to actually tap your toe down maybe it hovers off the mat as long as your spine is not moving <sighs> keep it going eight Six, curl an inch or two higher. Keep breathing, pull these ribs down. Give me three, give me two, give me one. Hold here, hands behind your thighs. Curl up just an inch more now off of those shoulder blades. Pull this down, keep it, pump for your 100. Here we go. 
Big arms, breathing through nose, exhaling mouth. This is a stamina exercise. Four more, you can do it. Head down to modify. Two more. Strong arms and abs. Last one. Exhale, five, four, three, two, one. Pull it in. Rock your head side to side. My abs are on fire. Rock yourself up. <laughs> Woo! Let's get into this thing. Separate your legs, the width of your mat. Flex your feet and sit up as tall as you can. Now chin to your chest, dive forward over an invisible beach ball. Roll back up, restack your spine using your core. Repeat, head, shoulders, middle back, hold, reverse, middle back, shoulders plug back to the top. One more slow. How can you segment your spine? Now let's go a little quicker. Dive, dive and lift. Repeat, pull your belly back. It's not about stretching your hamstrings here. It's about articulating your spine. Use your abs to restack your body. You're being punched in the gut. Woo. Last one. Hold it here. Little pulses. Eight, seven. Keep drawing this back to the wall behind you. Three, two, and one. Sit up tall. Already scoot forward on your mat. This is my favorite. <laughs> Hands behind your knees. We're gonna use everything we just learned. Pelvis rounds just behind your sits bones. Now pick up your feet and balance. Pull yourself into the tightest ball here. It's like you're balancing on your butt cheeks. Now if you've got any back issues, stay in your balance. Advancement, rock to shoulder blades. Rock back up for rolling like a ball. Keep going. No pressure goes onto your neck or your head. Keep your heels connected. Keep your motion, ooh, smaller than mine. <laughs> what? Keep going. Round and scoop. And up, your abs are the brakes. One more. Okay, here's the fun part. Hands to the fronts of your ankles. See how I made a tighter ball. Here we go. Rock and roll. Shoulders down, rock and roll. Abs are in. Four more. Four. Woo. Pull the abs back. Up to balance. Two more. Two. Shoo. Baby, one more. Balance and I'll hold it. Now reach arms out. No hands, mom. Go. Oh, way harder, just if you were there. Try not to let your heels go away from your booty. Last one, oh my gosh, that's hard. Ooh, rock it up and balance. Extend your legs, touch your toes. Okay, after you touch your toes, sit up. Elbows go back behind you. Chest lifts up nice and high. You're pushing your arms down. You bring both those legs back to tabletop. So remember, knees over hips. Squeeze your inner thighs. Can you tick-tock legs over one side? And bring it up. Other side. Over. Oh, it should feel good to start off. But notice how my upper body is not moving. I want you to think of a long spine, not rounded like the last two exercises we did. Long and pretty straight with a natural curvature. Hold it to one side, stretch your legs straight. Bend, other side. Passing through center slowly. Ooh, you should feel obliques turn on on those. Squeeze inner thighs, stretch, bend. On one butt cheek, stretch, bend. Ooh. On your next one, hold it. Legs stay straight, bring them up. And side, again, squeeze inner thighs up. And side, keep it going, abs in. Toes pointed, belly button. 
to spine. Woo, baby. Squeeze those inner thighs for me. This is our hip circles. <sighs> On one butt cheek than the other. Oh, it's burning. One more each side. Push those arms down. The last one, hold it at the top. Tiny scissors without moving hips. Use your inner thighs, bend your knees if you need to. Right here for 10, nine, eight, seven, six. You are almost finished, baby. Four, three, two, one. Make a butterfly. You might get a little bit in your hip flexors. That is A-OK. -okay. At least our abs are turning on. Alrighty, flip on over. Honestly, my favorite exercise, and I have not been teaching it nearly enough or doing it enough, push your forearms down, lift your chest up, zip your belly off of your mat, hold it there. You should feel the points of your hips pushing down into the mat as well as your arms and elbows. Kick your right heel in and switch. Without anything moving, it's from the knee down, uh, in, out, in. You should feel a stretch in the front of your thighs. Work in your abs, your arms. Chest is lifted, it's extension, it's for your posture. But this is the best exercise if you're someone who sits all day. Your thighs and hips are getting tight, your upper back is getting weak. Two kicks, here we go. Kick, kick and stretch, switch. In, in, no rocking. I should be able to put my hand under your belly. In and oh my god this one like looks so easy but actually use your body it should be so hard kick kick use your butt it's work on your hamstring you're gonna see we're gonna do this one again in a minute kick kick keep your chest lifted kick kick keep your abs in Woo. seven six six and out Five, five, nothing moves but from the knee down. Oh, such a humbling stretch. Like, girl, why your leg don't move? <laughs> One more each set. All righty, lower down, hands underneath your shoulders. Big inhale, big swan stretch. Exhale, lower. One more time. Big inhale, swan stretch, and exhale. All right, come on to all fours, baby. Now we're quadruped. Remember your single leg kick. Okay, here we go. Take your right leg out. It's nice and long and straight. You've got a long line from head to heel. Flex that foot again. We bend, extend. That's all we do. I like to imagine you've got your thigh on a tabletop, so it's gotta stay there. Again, the movement is from the knee down. But the coolest part about Pilates is it's never about what's mobile, it's about what's stable. The rest of your body is stable. <laughs> oh, I'm just talking a lot because literally my hamstring and my butt are on fire. Let's pick up this tempo, 10. Nine, use your core. You should be feeling back here, eight. And in, and seven. And six, keep your thigh knee up. And four, woo! And three, my booty's on fire. And two sets. And one set, last one, hold the bend. Lower down an inch, push up an inch. Keep going, hip extension. And up, and up. My little curlies are in my eyes today. So dead, I did the, um, the pasta strainer diffuser, diffuser today, and I really feel like my curls are like a little bit better, to be honest. Really squeeze right where your booty and your thigh meets. So, let me know, do you see a difference? <laughs> Everyone's gonna be like, girl, bye. <laughs> Keep going. Push your heel to the ceiling. Oh, my leg is on fire, sweetheart. Let's go 10. Nine, eight, seven. My thigh is not touching the floor. Last four, and three, and two. Hold it up on one. If you need to modify, left elbow goes down. 
We keep this right leg bent. Can you rotate your knee towards me? Rotate it down. It's my thigh bone moving inside of my hip bone. I don't want your hip actually opening. Try to keep your spine still. I'm getting lots of core right here too. Keep your thigh lifted, baby. Three, Woo. two, now hold it open. Go up, down right here, up, up. If you're a dancer, this is your attitude. Whew. And if you're leveling up today using an ankle weight, good luck to you. Squeeze, but it's always a good idea. Challenge yourself. And up, if you wanna stay advanced, both arms, right? Your lower back is not moving. Oh, lordy. We got 10 more, y'all, 10, nine, eight. You're almost there, seven. You're almost there, six. Breathing, four, three, my butt's cramping, two. Hold it up on one, flex that foot. We stretch and bend it up. This is the same hamstring curl we did before, but now we're externally rotated. You can do it. Keep it going. And push, pull, and push, and pull. Whoo, honey. Almost there. Let's go eight. And seven, my right behind is literally on fire. Six. Last four. Ooh, three. Push it, baby. Two. Hold it out on one. Hold it there. Five. Lift it an inch higher. Hold it. Do not move that leg. Three, two, one. Bring it in. I know you probably want to kill me. That's okay. I'm going to flip around so you can see on the other side but we got one more leg, here we go. <laughs> I want you to extend that left leg long. See how I push down with my arms? We bend and bend. Woo. If you're like me and you've got a tight thigh, a tight quadricep from sitting or lifting, you'll notice your knee's gonna wanna come down here. Challenge yourself to keep your stretch, y'all. And in. Keep that stretch of going, keep the abbeys in. No sinking like this. Keep it together. Woo. Oh, Lordy, Miss Cloudy. I know, Ugh, I hate it here. <laughs> but it's so good. I promise you, even your lower back is gonna feel better by opening your quad, I promise. Let's go eight. Six. Five, four, three, lots of resistance happening. Two, hold it one, we go down one or two inches, not all the way, push. Even though now is about the time I wanna give up. This left leg is not having it with me today. Use your booty, might be tiny. Mine is tiny today. Y'all. 10 more sets, 10, 10, nine, nine little pushes, eight, keep your leg bent, six, six, keep going, five, five, keep going, four, oh my God, my booty's on fire, three, and three, and two, and two, one more set up, and hold it, right arm can come down, we open kneecap to me, right back where it came from. We're working the mobility of your hips now, but everything else is stable. Open and close, wrap and open. I really feel my abdominals turn on just from trying to control the rest of my body while my leg moves. I feel right under that booty cheek, y'all. Let's go, three. And two, these are slow. One more, hold it open towards me. Here we go, little up, little up, little up. Draw your belly in. And I'm feeling lots of obliques, honey. And core. Oh, I'm feeling everything. Like, what am I doing? <laughs> 10, 9, 
eight, seven, uh, four, <laughs> three, and this is body weight, two, hold it up, now we bend and extend, out, in, out, in, externally rotate, Ooh. It's like I'm trying to point my kneecap up to the ceiling, but not from my hip, from my butt. Woo. I really feel the fronts of my hips opening, which is great though, because I've been sitting so much. Let's go 10. I swear this is gonna make me sore. Seven, six, almost done. Five, four, three, two, Last one, hold that leg long, freeze. Lift it an inch or two from your stomach. Hold six, five, lift it an inch or two higher for three and two and uh, one. It's literally rude. Get a sip of water. I don't usually give y'all water breaks, but oh my God. Okie dokie, already chokey. Last thing. Elbows go down. We're gonna combine everything we just did. Step your legs back in together. Hold it here. This will be your modification if you need to. Now, we hover from your glute, right leg lifts, hold it. Slowly put it down. Now, without shifting other side, use the same booty cheeks we just used. Keep going slow. Up, control. Keeping your core tight, your spine still. Six, keep shoulders over elbows. Seven, eight, Ooh. nine, ten. Lower down, take a breather for a second. Woo. Okay, next time we've got ten on the right, ten on the left. You're almost finished with me. Same position. Remember, if you need to hold, hold. Right? Just your right side. Ten. Nine, keep your left side still. Breathing. Six, four, squeeze your seat. Three, two, one, other side. No break, you can do it. 10, eight, I can balance a glass of water on my back. Five, three, two, one, take a break. Last time we just have 10 more alternating. This will give you a little bit of cardio, honey. <laughs> Here we go. Leg out, leg out, alternate one more time. 10, don't move your lower back. Eight, I don't care how you high your leg lifts. Six, three, two. Now guess what, hold both legs together. 10, nine, eight. Six, three, two, one. Sit your hips back, child's pose. Tuck your toes, give me a little downward dog, a little prancy prance. I hope you guys enjoyed that today. Definitely got my core fired. My whole body a little bit fired. I am fired. <laughs> But thanks for hanging out with me on your mat. Hopefully I will see you guys next week. Let me know if you liked this. Like, comment, don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notifications. And I will see you guys later on 